Hey, I wanted to introduce you to someone I know today. I was Shia Tua Tishka 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 Oh my god, what have you done? Why is, she, why is she mad at you? What have you done? Why is she casting something? Why is your furniture flying right now? Why is my fridge in, in the air right now? What is she doing? What is she doing? I don't know. You tell me. What is she? Is she a fax machine? She she sounds like the printer I used to have for like ten years. That wasn't that was none of that was funny. Okay, why are you making fun of a language you don't understand? How many languages do you speak? Cool. This is Pia, a speaker of the light language, the language of light, a power energy healer, a multi-dimensional frequency emitter. That's what she's. She's a radio. We thought she was a printer. No, she's a radio. So you out here thinking this is weird. What's weird is you not wanting to learn the light language. It's a complex one. It, c it comes in different variations. Among them, the dragon light language. A dialect of the light languages. And what it specializes in is something you need. Some deep energy cleaning. Okay, to rid you of your... Uh, judgment. She's just coming up with it as she goes, you know? <laughs> oh my god, is there something stuck in your throat? Is that what this is? It's just the language of light, okay? But the purpose of this is supposed to be healing, okay? That's the whole purpose that she's doing. So what I'm not sure I understand is whether we're supposed to participate in order to heal ourselves as well, or if she's doing it for us. Like, take a look at this, right? This is healing addiction, okay? It's pretty dense, okay? So, how does it work? So, are we, are you doing this to us, or are we supposed to repeat this? Because there's no way we're gonna remember like all that, you know? But the real question right now is, how far reaching is the power of the language of light? Power release. That sounds like something I would hear like if I was next door. In a, in a hostel. <laughs> I'm sorry. It was literally me. This was literally me when I was a kid. I thought I could control shit. I, oh my god. I was a creepy kid. I was that kid in the corner. They told you not to worry about. That was me. I was sitting there in the corner, in the dark corner. <laughs> Trying to move shit with my, with my mind. Yeah. Telekinesis, baby. It's just... One of my many skills. Shut up, because sometimes the power of the light language is far more reaching. Powerful implant removal. What does that mean? If I, are you gonna remove my implant? <laughs> With your words? My Brazilian butt lift? Uh, get away from my- get away from my ass. This lady's gonna like walk up to your butt. Girl, yeah, you best worry. You best worry about- the implants is the last thing you're gonna be worrying about. No, 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 ma'am. My favorite thing about this account is that it's not trolling. It is very much serious. Bia says, Please drink a lot of water after watching. These are powerful energies I was channeling. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
Okay, you know, sometimes, I'm gonna be honest, sometimes her energy channeling does work, but it only works when she's channeling this emotion. Happiness transmission. Don't smile, otherwise you'll prove that it works. I mean, try not to smile. <laughs> I'm trying to be open-minded, okay? But I feel like this is what happens when somebody loses it and has access to social media. I want to channel some happiness to you, okay? Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> First, there was Lilo and Stitch. And then she transformed into that one kid from the Wild Thornsberry. She doesn't always do it at home, though. Sometimes she's in the forest. I feel like that makes sense, though, because I don't know what mushrooms she finds in that forest. I can, I can imagine this actually would make you happier, though. <laughs> like, there's no way you can do that and then stay mad. Like, <laughs> Oh, there's no way. Oh my god, remember that one song went, um, what does the fox say? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm open-minded. Okay, yes, some people do want to learn the language of light. Okay, it's a shame it's not on Duolingo. Just try to make the same. Start with moving the arms how I move, and then make sounds <laughs> at the same time. Love. You. But that lady's not alone. There are others who also connect with the language of light. Like this one comment I found underneath her fairy activation video. <laughs> fairy, yes. <laughs> what is she doing? She's activating the fairies. I'm just looking at the comments, all right? Yeah. You're amazing. That was super powerful. Thank you, Pia. Believe in your power says this is amazing. To which Pia replies, Thank you so much. I look forward to seeing your expression of light. Just be happy and move your body. Now, I was curious. I started snooping around. I checked out Believe in Your Power's profile and only found this. Believe. Believe. Your power. So, now I'm scared, because I think I walked into a cult. I think it's giving cult, you know? But you know what you're giving? Hater. That's what you're giving. You need a little bit of love. And lucky for you, the language of light transmits love as well. But she has a beautiful voice. I'm trying to balance out the things I'm saying. <laughs> I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be nice, okay? But there's only so much I can be nice about. Let me, let me be honest here, okay? Because when you start speaking bird, Pia, I can't keep defending you. I can't keep defending you. I just can't do it. You know what we're doing right now, you and I? Do you know what we're doing? We're bird watching. That was a sparrow. Maybe you, you didn't like her sparrow. Perhaps you'll love her crow. <coughs> I told you we were bird watching. <coughs> oh my god, this crow is coming from her bowels. Like coming out of her bowels. <coughs> <laughs> you get pubic hair like stuck in your throat. You're like, damn it. I, how do I cough it out? Uh, or you take your car to the mechanic and you don't know how to describe like the sound it's been making. The mechanic's like, so what's the problem? And you're like, I don't know, that's for you to find out. Okay, but like, why are you here? Because it's making the sound. She's even signing it. For those of us who can't hear her. I, th I, think, I think that was a lot of internet for today. This is what the internet has given us, you know? It's beautiful. I think it's amazing. The ability for people to just express themselves like that. I, I think it's actually really cute. You know, at the end of the day, while it is traumatic to see, she's just, you know, expressing herself through the language of light. Perhaps one day you could do the same. Express yourself through any language you like. You like, we want to speak bird? Be my guest, babes. You want to speak fairy? <laughs> you know what, but now I'm thinking about it. Is it the pandemic? I think ever since the pandemic, 
<laughs> Things have been a little weird, huh? I do love her though. She's got a positive vibe to her, you know? She's a little scary. I'm not gonna lie. I am a little scared, but she does have a positive vibe to her. So only love, only love to her, all right? But what do you think? How many languages do you speak? Nice. Well, you can add one now. You just need to pretend there's a pubic hair in your throat and you're good. Now you speak the language of light. Now you speak the language of light. You are a speaker of the truth. You can now transmit frequencies and energies. Yeah, I... Uh... Look, I'm just kind of speechless, you know? This whole video is kind of like, put me in a place where I really just don't know what to say at this point. It's, I blame the pandemic. I do think you should definitely go to bed. I don't know if you would be able to sleep though, you know, knowing that there's someone in the forest chanting things at you. So here's a lullaby. It's a good night lullaby for sleeping. So Ha, ha, ha.